Big Bill Anderson's death tours rolls on here at Palm Desert Cemetery here in Las Vegas, here at the uh, gravesite of a gentleman that I had met a couple of times, Buffalo Jim Barrier. And I had promised Jim's daughter, Jennifer, that I would come by here and pay my respects to her father. I haven't been here in four and a half years, and for that I am sorry. But Jim was a really good man. He was quite a character here in Las Vegas. He was, as the headstone here reads, a loving father, grandfather, brother, and son. And on April 5th, 2008, Jim Barrier was taken from us at a Motel 6, just a few miles from here. And I do believe, as his family believes, he was murdered. Jim Barrier, his life came to an end because he rubbed some people the wrong way. And for those of you that say there is no mafia or no mob, well, my friends, there is. And it's alive and well here in Las Vegas. Has been since Bugsy Siegel in the 1940s came here and it's alive and well today and I just wanna want you to read this down here below uh, Jim's very unique headstone which I absolutely love and it says a true renaissance man best known for fighting crime and corruption in the city he loves Jim ran a automotive shop repairing cars this is him in front of his shop right there and right next to that building just on the other side over that way right there was the Crazy Horse 2 nightclub uh, strip bar run by the Mafia well Jim had a lot of run-ins through the years a decades worth and uh, one of the gentlemen that, uh, I use that word loosely, that owned the building or uh, owned the business was sent to prison for tax evasion and a number of other things and served a year and a day in jail. And coincidentally, one week after his release from jail, after swearing vengeance on Jim Barrier, well, Jim Barrier's life came to an end one week after this gentleman left prison and returned here to Las Vegas. So I am here at Palm Desert Memorial to pay my respects to Mr. Barrier here. I am so sorry that your life had come to an end. You know, everyone here, everyone buried here has a story. Everyone. But I can tell you this, this man right here, Jim Barrier, had one hell of a story. And I admired Jim, respected him, and I just wanted to come by on my death tours while I'm visiting Las Vegas here on the 17th of December, 2018, and say rest in peace, Jim. Your family loves you. Your friends love you. We know what happened. And I don't think any of us will rest until something happens with this case. The city of Las Vegas, the police department are a little too lazy to reopen. And it's easier just to say, oh, he died of a heart attack or he died of this or he died of that instead of looking at the facts of the case. Well, Jim Barrier, I won't rest. Your daughter Jennifer won't rest. None of us will rest until the truth has been found out. So Big Bill Anderson is right here in Las Vegas. 
my friend Jim's grave and I just want to say thank you for listening to what I had to say here at Jim's grave please like subscribe to my channel rest in peace Buffalo Jim